Hi friends, welcome to our channel Knox Way to Aptitude. In the previous video, I explained you concepts and some basic problems in this pro in this topic, ratio and proportion. And if you did not watch that video, I request you to please watch it before coming to lesson number two, so that you can easily understand and follow. Now let's go to the first problem in lesson number two. If 2a is equal to 5b is equal to 4c, find a is to b is to c. Okay friends, we can solve this problem in two ways. First I will explain you in conventional method. Actually we should not follow this conventional method in competitive examination but for your concept I will explain you the conventional method. After that I will explain you the shortcut. So here 2a is equal to 5b is equal to 4c is given. So first you take these two terms and 2a is equal to 5b this b comes here and it will become a by b this b comes here and it will become a by b and this 2 comes here and it will become 5 by 2 so a by b is equal to 5 by 2 therefore a is to b is equal to 5 is to 2 now you take these two terms 5b is equal to 4c now this c comes here and it will become b by c is equal to this 5 comes here and it will become 4 by 5 so b by c is equal to 4 by 5 therefore b is to c is 4 is to 5 now we have a is to b and b is to c from these two we can easily find a is to b is to c just like some problems in lesson number two so to find a is to b is to c first we write a b c what are the values of a and b 5 is to 2 and what is the value of b is to c it is 4 is to 5 b value 4 and c value 5 after writing like this we multiply these two terms 5 4 are 20 is to 2 4 jar 8 is to 2 5 jar 10 and we got 20 is to 8 is to 10 and in these three terms we can uh, there is one common factor that is uh, 2 so if you cancel 2 2 takes 20 10 times 2 takes 8 4 times and 2 takes 10 5 times now the answer is 10 is to 4 is to 5 a is to b is to c is 10 is to 4 is to 5 we can solve this problem like this but it is easy to follow the shortcut method so 2a is equal to 5b is equal to 4c is given here we need to find out the value of a is to b is to c so a is to b is to c First we want this a term, so first you leave this 2a and you multiply these 5 and 4, 5 4 are 20. Now we want this term, b term, so you leave this 5b and multiply these two terms, 2 4 are 8. And finally we need this c term, so you leave it, multiply these two terms, 2 5 are 10. Okay, you understand first we want this a term, so leave it. You just multiply 5 1 4, 5 4 are 20. Next, leave this term and multiply these two, 2 4 are 8. And finally, you leave this term, multiply these two, 2 5 are 10. So we got 20 is to 8 is to 10. And we can cancel 2 here, 2 takes 20, 10 times, 2 takes 8. 4 times and 2 takes 10 5 times so the a is to b is to c is 10 is to 4 is to 5 here just like 10 is to 4 is to 5 this is the shortcut method let's go to the second problem a b and c together have 8118 rupees 4 times of a share 3 times of b share and 6 times of c share are equal then find the share of c here what is the condition 4 times of a share, 4 times of a share, 3 times of b share, 
and six times of C share are equal. Equal is nothing but is equal to. That means we got 4A is equal to 3B is equal to 6C. So just like in the previous problem, from this 4A is equal to 3B is equal to 6C, we can easily find out A is to B is to C like that. So first we want this A term. So multiply these two. 3, 6 or 18 is to now we want this term so multiply these two 4 6 or 24 and now we want c term so multiply these two term 3 4 or 12 so 18 is to 24 is to 12 so in 18 24 and 12 i think we can cancel 6 6 takes 18 3 times 6 takes 24, 4 times, 6 takes 12, 2 times and finally we got A is to B is to C is equal to 3 is to 4 is to 2 and the total parts of A, B, C is 3 plus 4, 7, 7 plus 2, 9. So now what is asked in the question, find the share of C. What is the part of C here? 2. So, C share is equal to c part is 2 therefore you write 2 by 9 into what is the total amount 8118 rupees ok uh, <coughs> now 9 takes 81 9 times 9 doesn't take 9 1 therefore you put 0 and take 9 18 2 times 2 into 9 0 2 so 1804 rupees. So C share is 1804 rupees. Suppose if B share is asked, you, you have to take 4 by 9 into 4 by 9 into uh, 8118. If A share is asked, you have to take 3 by 9. Okay friends, if this is useful to you, please like it and share it to your friends so that they can also learn. And if you have any doubts in this lesson number 2, please ask me in comment section, I will reply you. And to get many more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel, Nags Way to Aptitude. Thank you.